Hello friends, this is the last video in the series of previous year's questions analysis of Political Science and International Relations CSE. In this last video, I will discuss the miscellaneous questions asked in last five years CSE, specifically asked between 2013 and 2017. However, before begin the topic, let's have a brief introduction. Optional subject, political science and international relations. Exam, civil services main exam. Paper 1 and 2. Topic, miscellaneous. Purpose, understand the question pattern to improve the answer writing skill. Certain questions I kept under miscellaneous section. It is not mean that these questions are out of syllabus. Of course, these questions are from the syllabus, but not directly from this specific topic. Rather, some questions are clubbed with two or more topics given in the syllabus or clubbed with the current affairs. Secondly, the purpose of categorizing as miscellaneous is to aware you in advance that sometimes UPSC asks some questions clubbing two topics or mixing with current affairs as well. So get ready for such questions in advance. Now let's check out the previous year questions. Political Science and International Relations Miscellaneous Questions Paper 1 and 2 Year 2013 The first question of such type is the economic content of India's foreign trade is increasingly growing. Substantiate the statement with economic diplomatic engagements of India in the last decade. The second question is, collective security and collective defense are the institutional and state mechanism to sustain the domination of powers that be in international politics. Elaborate. In 2014, the question that is, India has thrown up a form of judicial democracy that has no parallel anywhere else and has nurtured a kind of civil society that is uniquely its own. Bhikhu Parekh, Paper 1. This question is asked in Paper 1. Next question is, Ukraine crisis is a product of power politics and geopolitics. Comment. This is asked in paper 2. Now come to 2015. The question is, examine the challenges to sovereignty of the state in the contemporary world. This question is asked in paper 1. Next question is, what are the real objectives of Millennium Development Goals, MDG? Do you think that Millennium Development Goals have been able to achieve the desired goals of poverty alleviation and sustainable development? The next question is, discuss the humanitarian role played by India in the crisis-stricken Gulf countries like Yemen and Iraq. This question is asked in paper 2. Now come to 2016. The question is, the political ideology of globalization is neoliberalism. Comment. This question is asked in paper 1. Next question is, discuss the right to information and underlying challenges being posed before it. This question is asked in paper 1. Next question is, a combination of internal pressures, ethics and regional forces and external threats that is EU, UN, TNC, global market, etc. has produced what is commonly referred to as a crisis of the nation state. Elaborate. Next question is, the IMF, World Bank, G7, GATT and other structures are designed to serve the interests of TNCs banks and investment firms in a new imperial age. Substantiate with examples of governance of new world order. 
The last question of 2016 is discuss the shift of India's foreign policy towards Pakistan in the light of Pathan Court incident. Now come to 2017. There are seven questions in 2017 of such type. The first question is postmodernism, that is of essay type, asked in paper one. The second question is what do you understand by multiculturalism? Discussed Vikhu Parekh's views on multiculturalism, that is asked in paper one. Next question is write a brief note on the end of history debate asked in paper 1. Next question is a state subvention or funding may be an effective instrument in strengthening electoral democracy in India asked in paper 1. Next question is in the post liberalization era Indian politics is moving from inscriptive politics to developmental politics. Next question is Examine the LGBT, lesbian, gay, bisexual and transgender movement in developed societies and how it is effective the political participation in developing societies. Asked in paper second. The last question of such type in 2017 is the treaty of perpetual peace and friendship between India and Bhutan needs to be revised with more pragmatic realistic obligations and responsibilities comment asked in paper 2 so it is all about the miscellaneous questions asked in last five years that is especially from 2013 to 2017 it will definitely give you an idea how to prepare such miscellaneous questions in advance besides we also provide comprehensive study materials of political science and international relations. Our study material is unique not only in terms of content but also in terms of presentation as it is presented through maps, images, graphs and tables. On top of this, we provide political science study materials in black and white as well as in color print at the printing cost only. Interestingly, if you want to buy only one part of study materials, you can buy that. Accordingly, you can buy one part or two parts or complete study materials depending upon your requirement. The price structure is given in detail in the following table. To buy our study materials, you can call us at given number or else you can email us at given email id. However, to get free PDF file of this question analysis, share your email id in the comment box or you may email us your email id at etcstudy at gmail.com. Wish you good luck.